What's up sisters? Today I'll be showing you how I define my curls using the quote unquote, I guess, wash and go method for type four naturals um, because wash and go is such kind of vague. And for type four naturals, we kind of have to actually just, you know, get out the shower, sit down and literally do our hair for like two hours <laughs> to get our curls to define. And um, yeah, I actually learned how to and uh, found out that I can make my curls pop doing this method actually two years ago because out of the 10 years I've been natural, I never thought I would be able to define my curls without using that technique that I did with the Denman brush with the whole bumping and curling. No, I actually found out I could do it using my fingers and taking my time and being patient with my hair. So let's get into the tutorial. I am of course using my leave-in conditioner from Main Choice Type 4 Leaf and I'm also using my Mel's Organics um, Curl Refresher which is mainly water at this point because I do refill it up with water sometimes. So it can you can use water or you can use refreshing curl spray. But as always I always part my hair, um, the long part of my hair from the top since it is cut into a tapered style. As you can see my hair is growing debating on what I'm going to do with it, cut it or just keep letting it grow. I don't know yet. But I'm also um, separating my sides from the back. I always start in the back. My hair is clean, fully dry. Well not fully dry but almost dry. The gel I'm using today is the Thick and Shine Styling Gel, my favorite gel by Fantasia Icy. And it's um, a protein gel. I have high porosity hair so it works really well in my hair. Some people low porosity may not want to use it. Um, for the short part, for the shorter strands, I finger coil like at the nape of my neck in the back and at um, the temples by my ears. My shorter pieces, I just finger coil. But for the longer pieces, this is the wash and go method that I'm talking about. Um, you can call it shingling. I don't know. I didn't think my hair would be able to do this. but. I, um, first spray my hair make sure your hair is soaking wet I make sure my hair is really wet using the curl refreshing spray or some water and then I apply the gel from root to end um, I would suggest using a lot I have to use gel to clump my curls some people probably ask well why don't you use a moisturizer cream that doesn't clump my curls it doesn't control the frizz period never has that's why I always resort to gel when it comes to defining my curls so um, I'm going to detangle and use the Denman brush not to bump my ends but it does help separate the strands so I'm just using that Denman brush to actually help me separate my strands more because I have to go through each strand and rub it through um, my fingers so I'm just using the Denman brush it does help define a little bit but I have to actually go through and separate them and smooth them out to bring out my curl pattern more as you can see I'm just rubbing it through that was actually too big of a strand so I separate them even more and I'm just rubbing my strands through my index finger and thumb or middle finger and index finger sometimes running from root to end you have to go I'm going through each strand so this is almost as tedious as doing finger coils but just a little bit faster I'm going to show you that again far away I'm spraying my hair make sure that my hair is soaking wet and then I'm going to apply the gel again from root to end making sure that my all the strands are covered my whole hair is covered and then i'm brushing through with the dimming brush to separate the strands it's very easy but it's it's almost tedious and it takes a long time that's why i don't really do it uh, but it is it does last a good week and i'm just rubbing through going through each strand to clump them together and when you're doing this do not go back and touch the hair or strands until you're done and you dried it so as you can see, curls are popping. Now I finished my whole head. I want to diffuse my hair. I don't sleep on my wash and goes like some other styles I would, but I get a hand dryer and diffuse it. Now I didn't show it in the video, but I should have, but I actually bend over where my hair, my head is to the ground and the strands of my hair is facing the ground. And I diffuse in order to get my hair to stand up like this. I don't pick at my roots with my wash and goes I just bend over 
and diffuse my hair and it takes about 20 minutes now to make sure your hair is not crunchy hard always use an oil or spray oil preferably and spray your hair and this can soften your hair up and add shine to it at the same time and that is it that is how i define my curls i know i feel like that was fast <laughs> but um yeah it's i didn't believe i could do this to my hair probably like some of some of y'all but it's totally possible if you take the time and try if not it's always that two strand twist out three strand twist out pop them curls girl but i hope you enjoyed this tutorial and also check out another video if you haven't already like subscribe and comment below on what videos you would like to see more from me all right thanks for watching peace out sisters Thank you.